We start this week's story in our car, on the way home from picking up our two Maine Coon kittens. They're just over 12 weeks old and they're ready to be homed. By us. They were pretty good on the 90 minute trip back home to ours and although we took a couple of cat carriers, we decided it would be best to just use one on the trip back so that they could be together. We were a little bit nervous about what kind of reception they'd receive when we introduced them to the girls. Rosie had spent some time with them at the breeder and is pretty chilled anyway, so we were pretty confident that she'd be okay. However, Mona can sometimes be a bit, well, moany. That is, after all, how she acquired her name in the first place. Anyway, hope you enjoy this little video and if you do, please consider liking, subscribing and hitting that notification bell so you'll know when we drop the next video. And this is the moment where we brought our two new Maine Coon kittens into the house for the first time. There's Rosie. She has no idea what's about to happen. And I'm going to be quiet just for a bit now and uh, show you what happened throughout the rest of the day and into this morning. So without further ado, let me introduce you to the two latest additions to our family. Welcome along, Freddie and Oscar. Oh, here, here's Mona. She's she's not quite as accepting as young Rosie. She's thinking, what is going on now? What do we think? Mona? You okay? It's alright. It's alright, Mona. You used to have this stuff to yourself, didn't you? And how are these two together? Hello, it's alright. Who's growling? You like that? You are a purr cat. You're a tunnel cat. And you're a growl cat. Rosie, are you keeping watch? This is Mona. Mona likes that. Rosie. This. Who's grumbling? This is Fred. Fred? Hello. And this is Oscar. Hello, Oscar. Good boy, Fred. 
ready. And that takes us through the first few hours of our time with Oscar and Freddy. No major dramas, unfortunately. Rosie doesn't seem bothered one little bit. Mona, well, Mona needs a bit more time. But we expected this. She'll be okay. As for the boys, well, they're great. Settled in nicely, as you've seen. And as you'd expect from kittens that have been socialised well by someone who knows what they're doing. If, like us, you can't use a rescue centre to acquire your kittens and need to use a breeder, please choose carefully. 
do tend to get what you pay for. If you're not already, do consider subscribing so you can keep up with the ever-changing lives of Mona, Rosie, Freddie and Oscar. We produce videos at least weekly, and if you have any particular requests, please drop us a comment, as we'd love to hear from you. But for now, and until then, cheers. <laughs>